I'm Dr. Greg Florent. I'm a professor of biology at Colorado State University. I've been very, very interested in how mammals survive in extreme environments. Marmots are the largest of the mammalian hibernators that drops their body temperature right down near to freezing. They have their burrows up here in these rocky outcrops. The burrows will go deep down into the soil. Their burrows are below the frost line, so their burrows are well insulated. It may be minus 10 up here outside, but down below, it's still uh, slightly above freezing. That allows them to drop their body temperature to just above freezing and remain that way and save energy all winter long. Marmots, ground squirrels, bats, they will lower their body temperature to very low levels, close to ambient. They will remain at this low tissue temperature, body temperature, for anywhere from a week to two to three weeks. Then they spontaneously arouse back up to euthermic temperature, back up to normal body temperature. But they don't come out of their burrow. They don't come above ground. They arouse and they stay awake for only anywhere from a couple of three, four hours to maybe 10 hours. We still call it the mystery of the arousal because we don't know why they arouse. We do know that it is probably a metabolic signal and probably related to energy. So there's this entrance back into hibernation, this deep hibernation part where they stay down for a long time, and then they arouse. They may have eight or nine torpor bouts in the hibernation season, which is from about September to March or April. And I always joke because people say, well, what do they do when they arouse? And I say, well, they read another chapter in their book, might you know talk to somebody for a little bit, and then they go back to sleep again, so to speak. Remember, there's no food for them to eat out here. So they're relying on their endogenous fat stores to get them through the winter. Well, clearly, evolutionarily, an animal that is able to sleep longer and deeper is going to be able to survive a period when there's cold weather and there's no food. 